Hello, my name is Jackie Perry. I'm the executive chairperson for the Osaka Environmental Health University, founder and the proprietor of this university. This university is a private uh, research-based university which is specialized in public health, environmental health, and occupational health and safety. It's a university that are founded on the principle of enhancing public health or environmental health through improved training using research-based methods. We're looking at having a university that is going to talk about or look at uh, research evidence-based methods and hence we are looking at setting ourselves apart from different universities in that regard. Um, for us, this uh, university was born out of the maybe say 10 years ago when we had this idea of forming this institution of which we felt we needed to enhance public or environmental health. So this is how this university was founded. We're currently located in Lusaka here in, along Ali Kinkato Road next to Mount Choice. Um, that's the current location of the university. Um, for us, we believe that we are going to make a difference in the field of public health, environmental health and occupational health and safety in the sense that we want to train a cadre of, of people that is actually professionally based, research based and that's going to bring about evidence based information in what they do. And hence, for us, we want to be the go-to university to create um, solutions to the problems that are out there in the field of public health, of environmental health, and occupational health and safety. We're looking at having people who can support this institution by dedicating their lives to research and bringing about that component of finding solutions to what is existing in this country, the problems that are there. We do know for a fact that uh, um, the certain amount of uh, you know, diseases that are in this country are based on the fact that there's lack of environmental health support and hence we want to change that scenario. And for us to do that, we are looking at what can we do to create this. And hence we have, we've brought together a group of professionals, highly experienced professionals in the field of public and environmental health who need to make a difference, who will actually teach and inculcate in the students that are going to be here uh, research-based uh, uh, methods and applications so that the results that they produce will provide the solutions for the ever existing and emerging public or environmental health problems that are in the country. So um, I'm currently the ambassador for the Lusaka Environmental Health University. Um, I'm helping the university to liaise with the community and my fellow youths in terms of realizing the importance of environmental health. And this uh, is a component that a lot of youths are neglecting and I feel this is much of importance currently and this is uh, a cause that we all need to embark on. So uh, my role is to ensure that my fellow youths are aware of the importance of environmental health and what it contributes to the nation. My name is Gracious Wangila. I'm studying air levels advanced classes at Lusaka Environmental Health University. The classes are going on well, the tutors are friendly and are helping me understand all the concepts necessary for medicine and surgery. The experience was great, it's still great, yes, a lot to learn, a lot of concepts to learn. The environment in which this university is, is peaceful and uh, everything, well, everything is going on well. The tutors are explaining to detail, yes. In this lab, as you can see, uh, it looks really nice, very wonderful. Uh, so where we are right now, uh, this, this, this part of the lab will handle a lot of things. To begin with, lecture, lectures will, will take place in this part of the lab. And also, uh, this is where we do much of chemical elements and physical elements. Physical elements that include stability, conductivity, total dissolved solids, and so on and so forth. And then the lab, uh, talking about the lab, it can actually do a massive number of activities. In this case, uh, everything that we do in environmental health, you know, there is a part where water is very key, it's very cardinal to environmental health. And this is the part where I'm uh, specialized in, in water.
my role, one of my major roles is to engage. I engage with community leaders, I engage with our business corporate partners, and of course, I engage with any other partner, wherever you may be, with regards working together with Lusaka Environmental Health University. As I mentioned earlier, the university encourages women and girls to apply, especially those who are in service as well. And through these partnerships, I have been able and we have been able to bring partners on board. For example, we have Trade Kings who are already part of our partners here. We have When Females Lead and they're another organization that is partnering with regards to the girl child. So yes, my role is to come up with engagement meetings and from those engagement meetings, we call for them to meet us and we come up with MOUs and we draft them. Having drafted them, we agree that this is what we are going to do together with regards our liaising beyond and after for each and every uh, person who will come through our university. This university uh, provides three programs. BSc in Environmental Health, uh, BSc in um, Public Health, BSc in Occupational Health and Safety. And, and beyond uh, the BSc uh, programs, there is Masters, and subsequently the university will also provide uh, PhD uh, degrees in the same programs. Uh, like I said earlier, it's a specialized university and it focuses on these three related health uh, sciences that are about the promotion of health and prevention of disease. These trainings that I'm talking about, these programs are available elsewhere, but I think what distinguishes us from the other universities is because we are specialized and we're using very experienced environmental health officers themselves who have not only been out in the field uh, working as environmental health officers, but who have also gotten into um, institutions of learning where they were teaching. So bringing all these together uh, with the, their vast experience uh, and working using a model we are calling uh, work integrated learning, we think we can produce um, environmental health officers here who are very well trained and and adequately prepared to uh, meet the needs of industry. <laughs>